Well, hello. So, I've done some subway work. And some testing. got to the point of making a profit and that increased the monthly expenses so we should be okay an overview of what's been done is I've just put a little well, quite a big subway network together and linked it up all around the city not just to the railway stations now we're just going to scout for problems. So there will be problems. Fortunately, I got it to 500,000 shortly before a crash of desktop. Um, you'll see up here actually that I think it might end up being a, uh, another video that I make. I built a canal station. Just looking around at the moment. Some of the other things. I'm going to have an insatiable industrial demand soon. Should see some jumps in our population. Is that? Well, that was really helpful. So four hundred and seventeen. I will need to. Just the civics. I I haven't. I'm not sure if I brought them down. Oh, thank you. That was really nice of you. Foxy puzzle pieces. They're really really not worth anything. they should probably be built into the junction more trouble than they're worth that's why I stopped using them all that time ago oh, is this where the sure what I've done where now. There are some places, I think this up here, where something stupid obviously has happened with a road. Um, this is another thing that I did prior to the crash to desktop. There's a 
We're going to have super high tech industry demand quite soon. So it would be silly not to. to Get it in in advance, really. Okay, let's keep it going. Yes, it shouldn't take so long to get to that point. What on earth has happened to this underpass? This is a result of the volcano happiness. I didn't spot this before. No. Oh really, was it now? Okay. Okay, that's understandable. So we'll go scouting for other trouble problems whilst looking at the We also start demolishing the dry throughs when we see them. They really are good for nothing. It's a bit precious. I mean, I could potentially give you a bigger subway station. I don't know if you would like that. Oh, hang on. Didn't fix that road glitch up here, did I? This one. So four twenty five. There we go. Let's try the road for kicks. Yeah, I didn't think it was that actually because it was. Far away. So four three four, we are getting close. You don't have any subway. So a railway station right there. I'll tell you what before I look into anything. I'm going to drop a save.
hello again. Apologies if there was no audio in the, in the first part of the video. I went to mute it and then it didn't mute. So I muted it again, so there's a good chance it was muted. I'm also sorry, but I'm having my supper now. But just in case to recap, I just saved the game because I've been playing wild goose chases with transportation problems, and I suppose you don't have a subway station. So um, I played a little bit earlier this afternoon and so I'm just having some food. And uh, got to very close to turning a profit and got a population of 500,000. Almost to the point of saying, let's do some decoration, then we're going to crash the desktop. Um, unfortunately, yeah, right. I don't buy it. You've got a train station right there. No, sorry. I'll keep an eye on you, I've got to save. Well, we've had 34,000 people turn up, so... Um, So we should, in fact we've got the mega demand now. So the million I was going to give it uh, was the last my federal government hat on. I've said no more money. I have a region to build, damn you. Stop wasting your time and money on environmental friendly grass. check the funding so I did dial back some of the funding but I don't want to get drawn into the game of constantly adjusting funding hmm. I had a feeling that if I clicked on what I wanted the game would slow down there we go unfortunately I took another piece so I'm gonna do that I'm gonna mute myself and save you having to listen to that and hopefully unmute myself afterwards
back. So all according to the news ticker is fine. The population is growing. We have solid demand. some of the education is going up I think once new people start moving in uh, stop moving in <laughs> look it's 2007 why is she happy to find a flea market Thank you. Four, four, three. So we are getting there. The thing on the funds, yeah. Kind of need a you kind of need a prediction uh, projections. I suppose you have this in City Skylines. The City Skylines is the best, according to some guy on Facebook, but. Um, yeah, 443, four, we're near yeah, traffic, but I might be doing some decoration. I mean, I'm going quite early in the morning, so I don't really want to have a late night. Getting there. I'll tell you what I can do. Sacrifice a few hundred to stimulate. So we're getting there now. Thirteen thousand we're losing. So that four four two. getting a bit high up there. I think they are going to need a railway station. I'm doing fairly regular savings, so I apologise. Just wait while everything demelts. Let's go up to the next speed. Actually, no, it's not yet. Do this theoretically speaking to start with. I'm hatching a plan. I would have put it tight to the railway there, but. That wasn't really possible.
Let's see what that does. That business. <coughs> How long have we been going? 30 minutes. Well, I saved you, um, as I, I said this in the multi video earlier, I saved you an hour for nothing because of the C2Ds. And the subway work, so... That's a house of worship there, isn't it? Oh, it's Kobe Lansky. You are still moaning. Why middle class people such pigs? I mean, you'd think they would aspire to live in a... They would have aspirations to live in a swanky higher class gaff, yet play and pay rent of... Non swanky. Ninety five, we're down to nine thousand. Four, five, three. We should be good for things for now. This should give those complaining people a nice. Nice opportunity to find some work. Here I'm gonna do just do some decoration. Let's rotate it around as well. So once we've hit five hundred thousand I think I'm gonna save it and then look at everything else. Concrete blocks I find tend to look nice. Near flyovers, because you know they're being considerate and placing them where they're not much of an eyesore. I think we need some iron, which I think is up. No, clearly down. some industry building which is nice 453 I think we need something else but we've got grass there but have some iron still got a lot of room here I'll come to that when I do some decoration which I might do tonight so we're only losing 10 Barrels. Oh, getting longer trains now. There we go, there's some. There's a build up. Let's turn that around. We should have another burst in a minute so once I do the decoration that might be another video for the massive backlog I'll try and do an overview with some screenshots for the new year but as I said tomorrow's New Year's Eve and I'm going away in the morning quite early not as early as I thought but early nonetheless so I'm probably not going to um, be up all night. 
I'm sorry to say that area is Saint, let's see behind these two buildings. And apparently, the Maxis Theatre is uh, it's got very good seating. We need something else for those other little squares. Nice, I like the patch of grass. And some cement bags. Okay, that's that area. You have no road access. I don't believe you. There's utter codswallop. What are you? Stone Chateau. I don't go into other mode. Oh, so we've got a massive build up of things now. You're lying. Is there something behind you? That's what I'm struggling to see. You won't see anything there. Probably the best view. So, Mr. Shone Stone Shadow, or Shone Shadow, or Tony Shadow. No, I don't believe that for a minute. I think I, I don't know if I said it in a in a in a in a video that isn't a thing, or might have come up in the past. It's so hard to tell these days. I don't really know what it is you want from me. I'll take your park. I'll pause the game. Look at that, 96,000. We're very close. I'm going to save the game. I'm going to give you a big subway station. And then you're going to stop complaining at me. I'm saving the game and I'm doing this on camera, I'm afraid. I'm really minded to put the subway station. Um, which is, oh, you can see because it's the hourglass. <coughs> A big subway station here. But I'm keeping it closer to the action. If it gets to that part of the day, like me, you don't want to do that again. I don't want to do that again. Sorry about the sound effects. Now 
There we go. I'll put one here for now. I'll even face it there for you. No. Not even plumb it in in multiple directions. Originally, I actually had a railway line running through here. Sort of around here, actually. But that got lost when the airport came in. I'm not breathing heavily. I can assure you. I mean, I technically, I should really save it again once I've done this. <coughs> but, oh, I don't know. I don't. The game has been quite glitchy. I don't know why it's done an underground road thing there. Um, I looked into underground roads a little bit, but couldn't really work it out. It looks like I've done it by accident. We've even got a slip road. Not quite sure how it started. I think I just dragged, innocently dragged subway underneath it. And that's my, that's my lesson learnt. Oh, do come on. I've clicked it. If I click it again, it's only gonna it's only gonna take time, more time. I don't know if you can hear them, but the little blowing sound effects seem to come when I breathe, but when my hand is against my chin at a certain angle, it's blowing my breath into the microphone, so it's got nothing to do with the microphone. It is just being difficult. Um, I'm going to click it again. Yeah, there we go. Blue squirrely circle. Um, I definitely did click on it. Such is life. So I reckon I'll have to be up about five o'clock tomorrow morning, so I won't be having a late one. I can turn a profit. Oh yeah, that was helpful, thank you. Should we try that again? I've tried everything and it's lightning fast when you start a new city. As soon as you touch underground mode in any in any sort of form, um, it just grinds to a halt. Anyone who's listening, if you can tell me if my fingers are tapping, and I can use that to annoy you more with. Everything else isn't enough. Um, I'm not sure what to do with that underground road. Um, I might just delete that section of track and reroute it. So I'll probably get a pop-up telling me, you got a road that's not doing anything, you're a terrible mayor. <laughs> yeah, 
Yes, quite a my night last night was spent spent like this. Oh, for the love of God, come on. I've got so much patience, but, um, you know, there is a limit. I'm going to hear the music any second now. Do -do -do -do, do 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 I'll tap it for you. How about that? I've already started planning cities around this in my head. I was thinking I was going to have to just stimulate demand, but this out of the box thinking really I knew it had enough in it to be self-sufficient oh, sorry I moved my hand my head up further down the line as well fantastic we still I think we still got one more wait to go I'm afraid to say um, there's a I posted it on the Facebook group here we go of a railway arch that curves around nicely goes over a river in the middle of a town which I'm going to do in a rural setting eventually but after what I've recently learned about the on and off slopes if it's not going to use them then there's no point in them being there so I might have to revisit that unless I do it in a test tile just to say here oh, look what I've done there's not much point to it really though Come on, please. I'm desperate. <laughs> I would like to hit 500,000 before I take a break. Dearly would. So the future, I mean, those, when you press the simulator twice, the same thing won't happen. But also, um, you know, it's like everything else, there's so many different combinations of actions and reactions, both on the engine's part and my own. It will react to me, I will react to it. But that will change with the mod set, probably, I think, especially with the NAM. They've changed traffic simulator recently and I don't think it's customizable anymore so if they choose to change something then that will change the dynamic of your city but it's a uh, for the next big city new Verona which is going to be to the to the east so not, not being realistic there I chose this one because of the sea I figured it looked a bit islandy like like Venice is Do come on. Let's go hurry up. Um, yes, this is a bit of a template. What I can expect is a bit like the area that we are looking at. I wanted to. Um, where the avenue is, the gap between the avenue and the residential area, especially where there's trams and to put the environmentally friendly grass that I probably won't put except for areas near trams until later on but do you know something you have to do it because if you let it build whoa 
if you let it build um, I'm just laying this stuff everywhere now I've got to the point of not caring anymore which is not a good place to be come on that's a railway one so that's no good Take that away from the road. No. Oh no, we'll just expend it towards the road. That's a brilliant idea. God. If I wanted to do that, it wouldn't work. Oh, and then we've done it twice. Just delete that whole section. job done I mean you have got enough ways to get over there I'm not gonna wait forever just to go back into underground mode for a second I suspect it will be quite quick bear with me good to get it a little bit of quick access elsewhere right I should save it but I'm not going to in fact no I'm not I'll give it a burst at cheetah speed and see how that changed anything if it's a problem I'll delete it that area anyway but, but we want Were you actually uh, abandoned there? There you go. Build up. You have transport. Let me just get back into the proper rotation. Uh, we'll get there eventually. I think what happens is the thumbnail down here is... Huh, it was in the right rotation. Would you believe that? Well, we need to start making money soon. Quite big demands. I can probably start plopping down some skyscrapers, but I can't do that without money. And I'm not cheating to do that. The city has to pay for itself. Do you know something? Go. I haven't. And this is getting silly now. I'm giving you two, two subway stations on your own street. I mean, do you know how lucky you are? Yet you're having the audacity to complain. It's really not becoming of you, little simmy wimmies. Really. And we're all having to sit here for 15 minutes at a time to give you one station because you refuse to use it. And now we have to go back. And I'm going to plumb you in everywhere, baby. You've got no excuses. I'm not giving you rail. You have plenty of opportunities to get to rail as well. I feel like moving in a my sim there just to 
what's really the problem? Why, why, why don't you have work? I mean, it's not, it's not, it's not demand for it. Yeah, and it's not space for it. And at the moment, at least enough jobs. I think I've got roughly the right balance. I'm happy to tweak things. I touch the subway now, I'll probably end up with an underground road. Once I start making a profit, I can reduce <coughs> I can reduce the tax burden on low wealth commercial as well and there isn't enough of that I and mean, that's because of the, what we have I mean we don't have a ghetto area so the people move in and but we, we're going to end up with we're going to end up with a, a big city and that's when we now need to go regional and at this rate I don't think we're ever going to go regional so we won't always have subway networks although some of them might be used to join up railways and things like that fancy underground railway networks Probably not in rural areas, although maybe if we get to a point where we split the railway out, everything is sharing at the moment. Oh, come on, man. See the trouble you're causing? Why are you so selfish, people? You're, the people over here, you can't see because there's a swirly circle, but when it's the parked cars that look like minis or little vans, transit vans, there's two briefcases as well. And, you know, it's like, well, I heard you gave them two two subway stations, so we want three substations, uh, subway stations on our, on our road because we're better than the people that only have two. And if you don't give us what we want, we're going to complain and whine and ruin it for everyone else. Yay, half time in the, uh, the waiting. There we go, second half begins. I do have rather a lot to do, so I would be grateful if you could hurry up if you want to be finished today. I would love to say I'm finished. It's, I started this city tile in July. I mean, admittedly, I hadn't. I was going slowly because I was recording things to show and, you know, not rushing through. And then I got very busy with work again, so I didn't play for three months. But, um, and then I didn't play at all pretty much in December until, until the Christmas holidays, which we've got a lot done to finish off. But um, I have been known to knock a city out like this in about two weeks, sometimes even a week, with decoration. I'm going to have to slow down. Oh, now we've done this one this one, I mean, which is a fairly impressive looking metropolis, I think, and hopefully be very beautiful. I want to go, go away and think a little bit more before I finish off, before I go to bed. I'm hopefully turning in a profit. And then, what trees I'm going to use, so I, I don't know if at this point, I've made so many videos and then deleted them for one reason or another. You know, 
I went actually down in one whole cul-de-sac of fixing and it just didn't work so I've, this is my second attempt but that, never be afraid to have second attempts always improve something and then we'll improve it but um, yeah I've got to work out what tree trees I'm going to use but in one of those videos I I tried the Maxis trees and they did not go they didn't stick to the environmentally friendly grass and they didn't seem to stick to the background either so I think I'll use them in a rural setting but the ones I was using really slow a city down and my decoration techniques is something that I've had comments on before so that was something that I was really looking forward to show and that final decoration is where the magic happens sometimes it seems like we're a bit far from that there we go there you go. Link yourself up. While I'm here, I'm gonna admit that I could give you more stations or something, but I can't keep giving you stations everywhere. You have to learn to be a little bit self sufficient. Right. Let's clear that. Stop complaining about stations. Oh, mansion. <laughs> That's what happens when you give people two subways, three bus stops, five, five bus stops, six bus stops, four subway stations, six bus stops. Then what is really a five minute walk from your front door and you end up getting a mansion. And, and, and a golf course. That's a, that's a nice looking... That is a nice looking mention actually, I'm not going to lie. Yeah, I don't believe you. He has a tendency to um, pop up for no good reason. That guy. I have to take what he says with a pinch of salt. So where are you going? Oh, you are using the subway station. How special of you. I mean, admittedly, I could probably put some... ...against the... Um, ...the avenue. That'd be a good place for commercial. And then some of you lazy buggers can go and work here. Oh, you're, you're not having unemployment problems anymore. How nice. Um, I'm gonna wait and see it. He seems to pop up at the start of every year Complaining about Avenue traffic and sometimes even complaining about road traffic and he'll complain about the same road and the same Avenue every single bloody time And no matter what you do I'm expecting people to be swapping over and then going to the station, getting the train. So I don't need another subway station here. Four, five, nine. People are happy. It's not a massive jump yet and we do have plenty of capacity. So we've got, we're still at nine. Demand is through the roof, here we go. We're gonna end up with skyscrapers here, are we? Because I did zone high. I zoned high definition, apparently. No, um, high density. I think that was initially what I had in mind. Residential blocks behind. 
come on, if you can't find a, a job for five minutes from your own front door. There we go, we're really starting to kick up now. I would go and have a look around, but... At the moment, I want to see what these fussy people are complaining about. Well, that's an interesting pe looking piece of architecture coming our way. 97. We're just 7,000 down. Let's see what we'll do. We'll decrease the taxes on commercial for a second. And we can start turning a profit. Industry does take a lot of space. So I'll tax you down, um, tax you up a little bit. Someone's got a no road, or is that a no job? Just a little reminder. Please have a subway station at the end of my bedroom. And he's like, I want it right there. I want to get out, cross the road, go on a subway, and then go over here and go to work. Because I'm not walking. And have you seen the traffic? I'm not bloody driving, mate. We are doing quite nicely. Unfortunately, I would go around and scout for problems, as I've said. But Preciousville over here is making it a little bit difficult. I mean, don't you want me to give you some nice things? this building I've made it historical oh it's been abandoned oh I guess it was historical I really like the look of it though that is a shame oh look at that look at that Poor people living in a palace. Again, I can't believe that they're not. 474. That's quite a big jump, so we've got to look over here. We're still good. We're still good. 499. So we could have done that with about 250 simoleons. Generally, people are happy. I think we should probably be turning a profit now. Maybe not. God, they're still complaining. Can you believe that? Really? Vows are so precious. Four nine nine. Nothing seriously going on. Let's have a look at some graphs. Time still so hasn't even sorted itself out yet. Plenty of power. I will sell some off. Water, absolutely. Plenty of air pollution. Kind of steady, really. Water pollution is none. Garbage is none. Education is levelling out. I think at 500,000, I probably do need to. Do need to think of that. Carrying as we are for a few minutes, we 
should be turning a profit. We've got major demand, and by the way, no cheats. I have, I do have the demand mods, but I don't tend to use them. I use them in in, in um, agricultural cities because I don't see why people who live in agricultural areas have to be stupid. Um, so if I give them a primary school, the next thing I know, all the farms are deserted, so I, I max out the... I max them out. When we do get to doing residential uh, farming areas, I'm going to try a new tact. Anyone seen my old pictures on the Facebook group? They will look like little cul-de-sacs, but I'm going to try and just put them by the side of the roads now and have a sprawling, curvy road network with with woods either side as well, because you know they don't like traffic, and there's not going to be a lot of traffic because there's going to be more roads and more opportunities. I, I, I was effectively funneling them down inside the road, and that's not good. Wow. Earth is this Matt three two five B three two five. I don't know if it's new or not, but that is being. I don't mind repetition um, because of the region that I'm doing. Really, Italy, that you know, those places like Milan, a lot of the buildings, the residential buildings, do look the same. Various classes. I quite like that one as well, actually. So. Right, we're looking at 5.09. We are doing well. We have good demand. Are we turning in a profit? We're turning in a profit. Oh, oh my word, ever so slightly not. Down to about 90, 90 pounds now. It'd be interesting to have a look around the city, but I'm not going to do that now. We're going to damn well make a profit. 511. That roundabout looks like it's good fun. That bus is being driven by a drunk driver. Really should do some more fines. Yes, profit. Look at that. Way. Pause that. We will probably have to look at the education and everything else. I'm, I'm expecting that profit to be quite short lived. That's before the invite me friendly grass. That's right, I'm taking a break. But I will be back soon. Do a decoration special and then a hopefully New Year's Eve. This is the finished product, but you're probably going to have to wait until next summer at this rate. Teaser. Ciao for now.